Hey everybody, today we are doing the Swordless Challenge, um, which is kind of a fun challenge because it's way easier than all my previous challenges. So it's just kind of a break challenge. Um, I walked off. Um, but anyway, the way this challenge works is I can't really do damage with melee weapons, so I can't use pickaxes, can't use axes, can't use swords. But the best part of this challenge is I actually can use bows, um, which have been banned for a lot of previous challenges. Hmm. He's lagging hard. And she's off the map. Perfect. Um, that is a great start to this challenge. So really the strategy for this is just going to be knock people off the edge. Um, which is kind of the same as my last challenge, except with my last challenge I couldn't buy bows, I couldn't buy fireballs. This is a great upgrade. And it's going to be really nice to have a little break from the uh, very difficult challenges. Alright, we're going to buy ourselves Protection and Haste. We can get ourselves Iron Armor and a Knockback Stick. Okay, nobody has actually touched mid. So I have a good 8 Emeralds here I can collect. And then go back to my own base. I don't know where Yellow actually went. But they're not at their base. So we're going to break their bed. Um... Yellow unfortunately took my emeralds, but it's okay. Oh, they went over here. Which really sucks, because red just got all of their emeralds. So we're gonna hide right here. The hope is that red doesn't see us on their way out. Alright, red's on their way out. And there goes red. <laughs> that was a very easy way to get the emeralds that I um, lost earlier out of play. So now we're going to go back to mid and get some more emeralds. Alright, Gray just broke my bed, so I think I'm going to go break Gray's. So we're on a little even playing field here. Should be in this direction, I believe. Yep, right over here. He has a big bed defense and mining fatigue, but it's okay, because I had a knockback stick. Alright, we're going to back off a little bit. And go by invisibility. Over at pink space. Yeah, so we're going to buy Protection 3. Uh, invisibility. A fireball. Maybe a bow, too, in case he tries to run. Drink the invisibility. And now we're going to go kill him. And there he goes. Perfect. GG's. Alright, I think we'll play another since that first one went so well. And it's kind of nice to have a little break challenge. Alright. Game 2. We're going to start by taking care of our neighbor here. Alright. He's trying to hit me from there. There goes his bed. And there goes him. That was pretty easy. Alright, we are now going to move to the diamond generator between us and red, and then move to red. Red actually just broke blue's bed.
so they're almost surely not ready for us rushing them. Red traded with blue. Which means we're gonna have to do this kind of discreetly. Okay, I failed. Okay, I don't know if I can make this jump. I can make that jump. That's what I was saying. Uh, we're gonna run away for a second. Alright. We're gonna actually go this way. And red's gonna run towards our base. I was hoping they'd have enough iron for a fireball, but they definitely don't. That's fine. We're gonna not lose our bed, actually. I can void. I was gonna say we're gonna lose our bed, but... They are so far from our base right now. Alright. Get ourselves iron armor. Probably get ourselves a knockback stick, just for the fun of it. We are now ready for Red to come fight us. Quite geared, might I add. I don't think Red is really able to take this fight right now. Did they miss their fireball jump? Seriously? What? Okay, maybe they just made it harder recently. Uh, hello? How am I supposed to knock him off the map when he's stuck? What is that? Okay, um, we may lose our bed here. Triggered our mining fatigue trap. Yeah, he's right there. <laughs> he didn't even fully break the bed. I don't know if it was the mining fatigue or maybe he just didn't time it properly. That's hilarious. He's mad right now. Well, either way, we are now going to move to our other diamond generator and deal with Aqua and move to yellow afterward. That's so unfortunate for red. They tried to drop on our bed, but they just didn't quite get it in time. Aqua is over here at White Space. Oh wait, no, they moved back to their own? Wait. Yeah, they did. Okay. Yellow's gonna go kill Aqua for me. And then we're gonna run past both of them. Oh. Actually, Yellow just got destroyed. I don't know if Aqua knows I'm here though. Uh, hello? Sometimes they just don't take knockback, you know? It's okay though, because he's dead anyway. Alright, now to deal with yellow, I'm gonna do something I don't do too often, which is I'm gonna buy a bell. Because if I'm knocking people off. Uh oh. There we go. Because uh, if I'm knocking people off, a bow is a pretty strong weapon. I did not expect yellow to come back that fast. Uh, he called me racist in chat. That is really wonderful. Oh, he bought a bow. It's 
See if that baits him out. He's not gonna win a bow fight with me. He's also not gonna win by just running across his bridge. Alright, well that's GG. Uh, this challenge was a nice break, but uh, I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day, and uh, yeah, hope to see you in the next one.